tonight, a teenager thrown 50 feet in the air by a hit and run driver. And Paul, that driver is now behind bars. And tonight, the teen's mother is talking only to ABC Action News. Andrea Lyon with that exclusive. It, it, it's been a tough week. Almost a week ago, Adam's family didn't know if he'd live or die. There was no reason to question him being out jogging. The teen was out for a casual jog on Crest Drive. Those are the tire tracks. When investigators say Mario Lopez Morales hit Adam head on. From inside my house that night, I heard sirens. The driver claims he was fumbling with his phone, hit the teen and was scared, so he took off. And I knew that something was wrong. I told my husband, I said, something's not right. A crash that threw the teen nearly 50 feet into a neighbor's driveway. Adam's family says it's a relief to know the driver's been Caught. Because there's always that part that's there that's knowing that there's someone out there that could potentially be doing this to someone else's child. The crash left the 17 year old with multiple skull fractures and ligament tears in his leg. Slow progress every day. His progress may be slow, but with school wrapping up and prom in the next few weeks, his family says the teen is nothing if not motivated. And I think those are going to be the things um, that are going to drive him to keep fighting to get better. In Polk County, Andrea Lyon, ABC Action News.